This is how I coach you. This is how I guide you. And this is how you manage yourself on a day-to-day -day basis, knowing what areas you need to focus on in order for you to get the result that you came to me looking for. If you have been involved with me for any length of time, you have heard me talk about my five lifestyle principles more than you probably want to hear. And the reason I talk about them so frequently is that is the cornerstone. That is the foundation of what Clark Bartram Systems is all about. Because I've learned a lot over the years, especially when men come to me after trying something in the past that probably wasn't sustainable. Because the truth is, if someone came to me, that means what they were doing in the past wasn't working. And I typically get men later in life, after the age of 50, after you've worked your whole life, you've achieved success, but the one thing that you've not been able to really get yet is the body of your dreams, the body that you played in college with or high school or what you see on Instagram. I try and give you some perspective as to why, you know, focusing on abs isn't the right way to go. But really managing these five principles is the single most important factor in achieving the result that you came here looking for. So what I'm going to do in the following videos is I'm going to break down each one of those five principles. Mindset, meals, movement, community, and supplementation. But before we go into those, what I want to tell you is this. The way to manage your life and the way to manage these principles is at the end of each day, you just rate yourself on a scale of 1 to 10. 1 being least, 10 being best. Your number is 7. If you are at a 7 in mindset, meals, movement, community, and supplementation, you will have success. And better than anything else, you will have sustainable success because you're not approaching this just eating a certain way. You're not approaching this just walking on the treadmill forever because that is not sustainable. That doesn't work. A singular focus to fitness will never work. And taking the pressure off fitness by realizing that this is a holistic thing and not like this myopic approach, I got to just do this and I got to grind. That's no way to live your life. But managing these principles Using a scale of 1 to 10 is a great way to do it. So when you go to bed at night and you lay your pretty head on the pillow, you just ask yourself or you use my 60-day habit tracker or my book, Magical Mornings. You can get those. Just message us. You use those to tick it off. I was at a 7. I was at a 7. I was at a 3. Okay, if you were at a 3 in movement, the next day when you wake up, what area do you think you would need to focus in on? It's pretty obvious. Movement. So that day and that day only, you focus on getting that up to a seven. And once you get it up to a seven and you're maintaining everything at a seven, you're gonna have success. Sustainable success, that's what you want. That's what we should go for. So the following series of videos, I'm gonna break down each one of those principles by themselves, going in as much detail as I can to give you a better understanding of why it's that important that you're at a seven or above in each one of these. So I'll leave you with this. Here is the way I want you to frame this in your mind. One day at a time, sevens and above. Don't worry about six weeks, 12 weeks down the road. Don't worry about anything but the day you're living in. And you want to be at a seven or above in each one of those five. So here we go.